This is the pantry and recipes template walkthrough by built by Lauren Stahl. When you go to your pantry, you're going to see a list of your entire pantry, whether it's an essential item or an advanced item. And when you add the, if you want to add an item to your pantry list, you can click on either bought essential or bought advanced. I'm going to click on bought essential and I'm going to add, let's say I want to buy chocolate milk. It expires in five days if I buy it and it's a dairy product. Now, if I click outside here, you're going to see that chocolate milk shows up in my list. And if I'm at the grocery store and I've bought my item, I can click on these bought, this bought button. And now I'm going to head on over to the recipes list. These are all recipes that you can make. Um, feel free to add your own recipes. The ingredients, these, this drop down, this list all is populated based on what's in your pantry. So make sure that you add all the ingredients that are associated with the given recipe. Check off whether or not this is a recipe that you want to make. And then finally, the type of recipe it is. Once you have all this information set up, you can go to your pantry. And if you click on this show other meals button, this will suggest new meals that you can make based on the recipes that you said are available to make and also what ingredients are available in your pantry. It won't suggest any meals to you that are not in, that don't have, that you don't have ingredients for. And so now you can click on this button and find new meals to make every day or every week.